So guys, the boy Jeffrey from Jeffrey's World and welcome back to a part 3 of this beautiful abandoned hunt and sludge. I'm here with Bros of DK. Yes, He's I want to thank Jeffrey for taking me here. Amazing place. Thank you, man. It was a pleasure to take you with me. Yeah. Because I know you love uh, the good ass places. Yeah, the good. Yeah. The real places. <laughs> the places. Time capsules. Yeah. At this place is legit a time travel back in time. I remember this table was still filled with all the paperwork and stuff like that. But I still want you to smash a big ass like right now. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to check him out on YouTube. Bros Links down below. And yeah, let's get straight to this adventure right now. So as many of you know, you already know this place good. But I still want to show you this because I'm now with Bros DK here. And this place is literally one of my, actually my best abandoned places I actually explore right now on my YouTube channel actually. But many things are still here hunting trophies, a lot of hunting trophies, like foxes and deer skulls, I don't know, old books. Yeah Jeffrey, let's, let's look at one of these books, that's just amazing. Let's see what's inside of them, I think it's you're probably in Dutch or something. Yeah, I think these are Dutch Are they French? Uh, oh no, those, these are French books. It's French books? Yeah. Alright, it's nice. Satire, satire. This, this actually may, might be a Bible. You think? Yeah, I think so. Let's place it impressive. back nicely like it was. It's so cool to see the DK hold yeah. this. The abandoned DK, place. you know? Yeah, not this one. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Here's actually a coffee machine. Looks newer, not very old. Everybody goes to drink coffee, right? <laughs> yeah. It's probably a sort of um, man cave for hunters or yeah, something. A hunter's lodge, I call it. Yeah, I think it's more of a hunter's lodge where the the wild guys who like hunting come together and sit here, uh, talk about the hunting experience, uh, drink a little bit of Jägermeister, and uh, <laughs> just enjoy themselves. I think. First of all, the first time I came here, I actually thought there was actually a banned house, yeah. but it wasn't a house because there is no bathroom upstairs. Upstairs is actually only the attic, but it's filled with some mm -hmm. garbage and, and chairs and other stuff like boxes and stuff like that. But here's actually a very beautiful kitchen, a bathroom as well, with the power still working. I'm going to show it to you right now. Also, the water is still working. The radio as well, here. Previous time, I showed you how that the light was working. But I don't know for sure if it will work right now. Mm -hmm. for the light switch? Oh, oh, it's that one that was working. I thought it was that one. Now, is that light or something? Hmm. There's no light inside there. I don't know. Probably not. But it's so impressive that the electricity is still working here. That's so strange, actually. Check it out. It does something. Does the water in the bar also still work? I didn't check it out yet. No, those don't work anymore. Mm, so strange. Some yeah. things are from other are working. Yeah. Like the crane here. The kitchen. The kitchen. Oh. Oh, oh yes, there's water coming out of it. You Seriously? To, you have to push the butter, of course, but the, the, the pressure on the water is not high enough to get it through uh, the nozzle over here. So. Wow, that's so impressive, actually. Yeah. Is that normal that uh, water and electricity is still working sometimes? Um, I have had encountered that a few times before. I think that was around three times in Belgium, but long ago, like two, three years ago. But nowadays, you don't find places like with uh, with water running anymore. That's that's very special. Yeah, it's pretty unique, but strange as well. All right, 
This welder is working as well, like you can see. There's more pressure here. But even here are still some pictures. And the radio. <laughs> no, that's not actually so creepy. <laughs> not a good job. <laughs> oh, there's some vodka left. Some good damn vodka. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's have a taste. No? I'm gonna smell it real quick. Feel right? free. <laughs> Ooh, that's strong stuff. <laughs> there's actually no expiry date on it. No, vodka never expires. That's alcohol, so right? Cool. Some What's this? Some bacon or something? Bacon rings. No, those are anchovies. Oh. Those are little fishes. The Dutch love wow. them. Yeah. <laughs> I never checked the, the fridge actually. Some onions here. This actually, Jeffrey, did you notice this? This is where they cut the meat of the animals on. Really? Yeah. You can see here, these are the clevers. So to cut them, cut the animals. And uh, they used all these tools to cut the meat. And uh, yeah, this was the table to prepare the meat on. Wow, I never yeah. noticed that actually. I saw the, the, the cleavers, but I never noticed that this table was actually for, you know, cutting for animals. To cut yeah. animals, yeah. Yeah, this is a sharp, of course, knives. Yeah. Wow, wow. so impressive to see actually. Yeah. Here's actually a little bird cage. No bird inside of there. Yeah, it's a sort of small tree. Oh, here's a pig. <laughs> <laughs> Some more oils. Hmm, what the hell is this? Strange. So, a tiny kitchen. It's very beautiful. Especially to see the old stuff that is left behind. I'm wondering which books these are actually. It's more Bibles. It's all in French. Yeah, but I just saw a Dutch book somewhere. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know we are in the Dutch part. Of, we are very close to the French border, right? Yes, uh, yes. We are in the Dutch part of Belgium. The Flemish part. This is a Dutch, a Dutch book over here. Uh, old Nick. Is, this, is it the one I just picked? Oh, just, oh no, that's, that was also French. Okay, I, oh. I had it wrong, I had it wrong. That's no problem. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> <laughs> Most of the old abandoned houses, the things we're gonna find, like books, are always in French or German actually. What well, is actually so weird as well. But here, the very beautiful coaches. I freaking love them, especially for taking pictures. The stove, the chimney as well, so impressive. Also, the ceiling is in wood. And there is actually that giant ass pig. That's actually a little bit creepy. <laughs> so, this is actually pretty unique. I showed you that previous time actually. But this is actually something for a telescope. And have you seen these, Je Jeffrey? Oh no. <laughs> these are, uh, yeah, <coughs> these wooden holders. It's actually, you can put them in there in your shoes to preserve the shape of the shoe. You see, these are the boots. I wow. think these are full better boots. Beautiful boots. I never saw that actually. Damn. You can see there's also a name on there. These were made, uh, most of the time handmade. Really? Yeah. Wow. I've seen a documentary. Yeah, I've always made on Discovery Channel. <laughs> they made those. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. A sort of toy here. A race for horses, I think. Maybe it will still work. I don't know. No, mm. look, look it's, it's locked over here. Oh. Oh, look at this. It's cool. That's the horse <laughs> race. Yep. <laughs> Probably self made as well. Who knows? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> so, previous time there were actually a lot of USB sticks laying on this table right now, but I think that someone came to clean it a little bit, or maybe it has been stolen or something. Because I think. This house has a lot of expensive furniture here. Yeah, sure. If, if anybody knows about this place, it just swaps mm -hmm, it all. Indeed. Like the coaches must be very expensive. I don't think he, that you can uh, buy that design in the, sh in the shops right no. now. Actually, I don't know. Look. Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> <laughs> those are boxes from glasses. Oh yeah, this is uh, Castile beer. This yep. is a 
really famous and lovely Belgian beer. Mm -hmm. I love this one. <laughs> I love that as well, especially the strong ass beers. Here's actually the basement, filled with garbage. You can see, nothing special, very tiny. But I'm not gonna show you the basement because it's too small and it's just some garbage inside, so nothing special there. Closed dooring. And look at this fox with a trumpet. Should that be a real one or something? This was a real one, of course. You think? Yeah. It yeah. doesn't look real. It doesn't look real, but it's stuffed. It's, you can see these eyes are not real, of course, but the fox itself is real. Wow. I'm very sure of that. Even this yeah. is from animal. It's that's a deer. It's from a deer, I think. It's crazy. You see the trumpet behind it. This is also very special, right? I think it, that is expensive as well, maybe. <laughs> well, have you filmed the register? The cash oh yeah, that's actually the best part here of this whole house, uh, aka lodge, is this cash register. That didn't open anymore, just... Oh! oh. <laughs> you got it open, man! But, no money. No money. Just some keys, batteries, other stuff. Some bricks? Oh, maybe, what the hell? Mm -hmm. mm, just some bricks here. This is first. Mm -hmm. Some more here. But no money. No money in the place. <laughs> Alright. It is actually from, it was not the Euro, it was Frank. You can see here right now, the brand is National. I don't know why he had freaky cash register and this lodge. But those books are pretty amazing. Must be special books, more glasses. Maybe this was a bar or something that uh, he can pay for drinks. I think uh, he and his buddies uh, just sat here through the day and uh, drank and had fun together. Yeah, probably. He just <laughs> made it for his buddies. I don't think this was a cafe or something like that. But it could be. It could be. It could be, yeah. It could be. I want to enjoy myself here when the place was actually yeah. active. I would like to get a drink in here. You can literally relax here, actually. Yeah. Especially with all the stuff. Here's actually another tiny room. And even here, nothing has changed. Just some... Frank Bryan, England. It's boxing. Boxing, yeah, so cool to see some sports stuff. Globe. <laughs> Even this lamp, it's crazy. A chicken, mini chickens on the ground. A guitar, small one. A golden dog. More books. He was probably a book lover. And a lot of statues. Another fox here right now. Man's head. I'm still wondering why the heck this head is standing here. Hmm. This is actually so impressive. Rugby. Rugby, yeah. Junior League. <laughs> Even this, check this out, fams. Florida. Florida. Alright. A lot of statues. All right, before I end this video, I really want to show you the attic real quick. Okay, here we are on the attic. Here's even more crazier right now. Like I said, many, many stuff here. A lot of shares, old shares actually. A lot of paintings. Everything is, yeah, just storage here at the freak attic. But I don't think the light is working anymore. There's no light anymore. Nah. <laughs> a pitchfork. Wow. Some horns. Probably from deer as well here. And many, many more statues there. Oh, there's actually a plane here. Oh wait, I never saw that. But now we do. <laughs> okay. So that'd be a casket. Or maybe it is actually a box for the guitar that we saw. Oh yeah, look at this, Leslie. I found uh, the storage uh, guitar. Oh, this is for a violin, I think. Or violin, yeah. yeah. 
beautiful. The violin, I did not in, nowhere in the house I did, I did see a violin. I don't think that's, that's left in here. <laughs> wow. These chandeliers are there. Wow. You saw the plane? Yeah, I saw the plane. <laughs> Pretty antique stuff here. Alright, I think we are now done. Yeah. I know this will be a short video again because it's not that big. So, thanks uh, Leslie to come with me to explore this right now. It's my pleasure. Like I said, don't forget to check them out on YouTube, Bros with VK. Very unique, amazing YouTube channel. They actually explored many, many cool abandoned spots around Belgium and Europe. It's just crazy. Definitely check them out. Also, smash a big ass like on this right now. Give this man a like. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate that. <laughs> All right, fans. Thank you for watching this right now. And I will see you another one. Have a nice day. Peace.